Hey everyone, BrickLover18 here today, and today it is a moving vlog. We are actually getting ready to move all of this Lego room, which doesn't even look like my Lego room anymore. We are ready to move it to Toronto. So it is actually the night before the big move. Tonight's goal is packing everything in the trailer into the moving truck so we can get it going. It's like, it's looking good, like everything's boxed up, but I'm just really nervous because I don't know how some things are gonna go. Like this box of just Lego bins and a bunch of just random bags of stuff here. Anything in this closet. Like, I just don't know. I don't know how we're going to transport it. I, I I just don't know. But we're going to figure it out because we have to. Because we're moving first thing tomorrow. Woohoo! Yay! I'm really, I'm really excited. I'm pretty nervous. Kind of stressed. But it's going to be good. As well, here's a sneak preview of the tables that we've been designing for the new LEGO City. This is just one section, and it also comes with two sections, two bigger sections. The city is going to be absolutely huge. I'm really excited. I set the tables up and just was kind of looking at it. It is so much bigger than I thought it was going to be, but I'm so excited to see what I can do with that. So I'm back, we're out here trying to fill up the U-Haul trailer. I'll just quickly show, quickly show how big this one is. Very big. This is just being recorded on my phone, not even my main camera, so sorry if the audio is not too good. But it's been a really chaotic night, you know, just trying to get everything put into the trailer. It's been a lot of trips into the house. I've had a lot of people helping me, so that's why I'm not really filming a lot of it. I've been taking pictures along the way, so you'll have already seen those. I'll have inserted them before. But this is what's going on. This is what it looks like. I'm piling everything in. There's still a little more in the Lego room to bring out. But so far, so good. And I'll keep you updated. I've also been putting a lot of city stuff here in the back of the truck. Just so it's a little bit more safer than the trailer. These here are just boxes of collectible minifigures. They're all out. The trailer is getting pretty full, as you can see. Still have one bookcase to go in and this table here, but we can definitely, we can make all this fit absolutely no problem. Hello, we're back, it's even later in the night. It is, you know, time's running out, it's getting cold, mosquitoes are out, but look at how much I've done. Like, this is all pretty much empty now. I just gotta put a couple things in here. We have to fit one more bookshelf, a couple of, figure out where these boxes are going, and this thing, and this trailer is jam-packed, like holy. Look at how full it is. Like, good thing we didn't get the smaller one. Because as you can see, it is very, very full. We even got stuff back here that I'm going to, like, try and condense a little more. And then, even more stuff is back here. A couple monitors. Still have a few things in my Lego room. But we're in the end stretch for at least packing. Unpacking is going to be a whole other story. Well, everyone, this here is, it's it. The Lego room is fully packed up and is ready to go. It's really insane to see this room empty after all the years that I've been filming in it. This room has been amazing. It really served its purpose. And I'm, I'm honestly really sad to have packed it all up now. It's empty. It's like, it's, it's gone. It is fully packed. Can you imagine? Like, this is what the wall color looks like? I like, honestly forgot. The tables are still in here. We didn't end up needing any of the materials for the new tables. Um, so they'll be taken down soon, most likely. Unfortunately, I'll probably end up losing the brick tape to go with it. I don't know how. I'll try and transport it or something like that. But, wow, it's really sad to uh, leave this room. It's Pretty big, but pretty cool. As I mentioned in one of the moving vlogs, everything that's in here is staying. We'll find another home for it, probably throw a lot of it out, recycle it. This bookcase is staying, I'm changing to white ones, as well as this is staying here and the Lego boxes. But yeah, so everything is packed in the trailer now. I'll take you back outside so I can show you that, but I just, I wanted to show you what the room looked like. Really empty for one last time. This will be the last time probably I'll ever film in here. So, wow, pretty crazy. All right, so this is the last look I'm gonna give you at the trailer tonight. It's very, very dark out now, it's pretty late. Time to turn it in. I actually, you just saw, I emptied out my leg room. 
everything is in this trailer now. It is ready to go. I'm like, I'm really excited to move into the new space tomorrow. But at the same time, I'm pretty sad because this has just been like, this is everything. This is my whole Lego collection. I've been collecting Lego for 10 plus years now. And I've been doing YouTube for seven years. And it's like really exciting that I'm finally moving into the new space. But it's really nerve, nerve wracking as well. It's, it's, I'm just really, I'm excited, but I'm nervous. But I can't wait to see what tomorrow brings. Hey everyone, we're back. Today is moving day, and um, it, honestly, we're off to a rough start here. As you can see, it's quite a bit later in the day than um, it's about 8.30 right now. We wanted to already be on the road, but for some personal reasons, we had to delay our departure a bit. We should be leaving very soon. Another thing, it is it's nice and rainy out here, so it's going to make for a messy move-in. Hopefully, hopefully, the rain has stopped by the time we get to Toronto, but everything's packed. Everything's ready to go and we'll hopefully be leaving very, very soon. Oh my God, look at how much stuff we've been bringing in. I haven't been filming much because it, this is, we've been busy and I don't want to distract from what the actual task is. Oh, holy crap. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Honestly, I packed like this to go on vacation, so I shouldn't assume my Lego room would be any different. Holy. This room is huge, and it's absolutely full. This room, this room here, just alone, is bigger than my current Lego room, and like it's packed, and then I still have all this to go, so this is awesome. Hey everybody, we are back. It is so much later in the day than when I filmed the last clip. I'm really sorry, but it's just been a really chaotic day. I've been with my dad, we've been like, bonding and making moving things and it's just it's just been a lot and I haven't had time to film like the camera we were on a timeline I'm sorry it wasn't as exciting as I wanted it to be I wanted to have like a time lapse of all this stuff coming in the room but it just wasn't possible with the time constraint and with how much stuff it took us about two hours to move all this stuff upstairs and we had to like get put an elevator in service and we it just also this we're on a higher up floor so it took a lot it wasn't just like walking down the street one up one staircase it was several stories in an elevator that's not the biggest so it was multiple multiple trips took two hours a lot faster than i thought it was going to be but still we had time limits so i didn't get a lot of footage film but i'm back and i want to show you what we've done so far so unfortunately he had to head back home couldn't stay very much longer so i've just kind of been here for an hour or so by myself putting things away we did get two of the bookcases built one came from home and one is brand new so unfortunately the one from home is a little yellowed but it's okay, I'm sure nobody would have noticed had I not pointed it out, and I'm working on building another one here. As you can see, lots of stuff. Four more to build, two more are gonna go right over here along this wall, and then three more in the studio over here. So the last clip I showed you <laughs> was a disaster. So far I've got the Pappy Mac storage containers in, the all the other containers that will have parts in them, over here is where my building table is going to go. I have to get it set up. And then over here, I put a smaller bookshelf with my TV. You all know I love to watch NCIS when I'm in here. And I have all the movies there. And I'm going to fill this probably with books and magazines and fun stuff like that. You can kind of see my view outside. I don't really care about the view. I'm here for the Lego room. Here's my city table. It is so big. And it's actually got an extension that's going to go on the end here as well. But of course... It's all full of pieces right now, and I'm trying to, you know, sort. I bought a new chair. Two new tables. This black one's for filming. This white one is for my building table. Really cool. If you saw my Instagram, I spent a ton of money at Ikea. I'm actually pretty... It sucks. But um, I'm really excited. Four more bookshelves here. And I gotta, like, navigate my way through this cardboard. Another chair here. Two more bookcases here, much smaller ones. These are going to be for sealed sets. And then everything over here, this filming area, is just a disaster. So as you can see, this is what it looks like when you first walk in. I've got a bunch of stuff here. The lighting's not the best over in this corner. But I've also got um, all new studio lights delivered. So that's really exciting. But um, over here, I'm going to have my set. Here, I'm going to have the white wall where I'm going to film everything. It's just going to be really cool. These are a lot of just sets and stuff that still have to be unpacked but this is going to be a big process like this is not happening overnight and it's like as i said it's pretty late now my dad left me 
as I said, it's pretty late right now when I'm working on this. I want to get hopefully two more bookshelves done tonight before I head actually home home. A lot of you were asking me in the comments, and um, I actually had some people in person ask this as well, but is this the same area as my house? No, it is not. I live in a completely separate neighborhood, completely separate building actually. I said in the last clip that I was going home, and well, that was a few hours ago, and I've been doing quite a bit more work. I did get all the bookshelves finished, all three, and then that one that was already done back there. I also got this shelf finished here. I have two of them, and I opened one of them up and built it. It was a pain in the butt, so that's why I didn't build the second one. I also built my table and got the chair ready. Not sure where I'm going to put these mini figs yet. All the mini fig cartons, they, just, they don't look quite right there, but, you know... We'll have to see. I got all the Pappy Max up there. Maybe I'll rearrange the Pappy Max to try and fit these in. I'm not really sure how that would work, but I could always think about it. Everything's all here. And over here, I did clear myself a path so I can go over here some more and take a look, you know, at the, the rest of the room. This is what I'm going to tackle tomorrow night after work. Come in for a few hours and do a lot more. I'm really happy with the progress. I think I'm going to try and get this half of the room set up first just because... It's the least crowded right now, and it's got the big city table, so once I get a lot of this stuff off, I can, you know, make this up, redecorate, and move a lot of the stuff, because this is a lot of sets for display, so once I move a lot of them, I can actually then build the set over here, because I'm going to have some bookcases, a bunch of my favorite sets on display, the camera set up, and all that good stuff, but of course, I don't really need to get that set up right away, because I don't even have any videos to film yet, because I haven't even moved in yet. I haven't unpacked, so why would I... I'm filming these videos, and that's what I'm worrying about the most right now. So yeah, that's really it for tonight. Um, I'm actually leaving now. This video is kind of filmed out of order, because originally I thought I was leaving, so I thought I was going to be done making the video. So I'll have to do some crazy editing, so if it doesn't make sense, you'll understand why. But yeah, these videos are pretty raw, not like my typical videos, but I'm having a lot of fun moving into this new space. I was really sad but excited. It's a big milestone moving into my house. Like It feels like I'm moving out and adulting, which is scary, but so much fun at the same time. But it was a really good day, and I'm happy with the progress, and I can't wait to come back and do some more tomorrow. So thanks, everybody, so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Definitely subscribe so you don't miss out. Have a great day.